Hey, what's up guys? Shark here, and we are playing Game Dev Tycoon. And I saw one of my friends play it, well, I don't know if I could call him my friend. Um, we don't talk very much, but, yeah, I guess he's my friend. Um, Sci-Fi HD, I'll link his channel in the description, you should go watch his playthrough of this. And he got me interested in this, and I was like, well, I'll get it, yeah. I'll get that. So yeah, we're playing this. And... Basically, what this is is it you get to develop games for like companies and stuff like that. And okay, here it is. In this business simulation, you have to been transported back in time to the start of your very own game development company right at the beginning of the PC revolution. In the next 30 years, you can build your dream company, create best-selling games, gain fans, and become the leader of the market. So basically, we start at the, around the 1980s. I'm assuming, uh, I think. And we're going all the way to current days and creating video games. So let's get started. And we're going to call this company Shark Bolt A Games. Shark. Mm, I am a male. No. Ew. Yeah, let's do this. Mod. Oh god, these they have horrible hair hairstyles. Yeah, it's good. Develop your game. Before development can begin, you have to decide what kind of game you want to create and give your game a name. You can also select which graphic technology your game should use. Your options are initially limited, but once you have a bit of experience, you'll be able to unlock new options. Okay. Alright, this is a game I wanted to create. Uh, no, I'll do that later because that one's ambitious. Very ambitious. Sorry, right, let's see. Um, epic. Est. Game. Ever. No, 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 no. Military. Let's just. Genericness. Action. PC. Next! Oh, son, 2D graphics. The biggest game ever. Two stages. At the beginning of each stage, you can decide what areas of the game you want to focus on. Pick the right focus for your game greatly increases the points you generate. Uh, areas are important for your game and decrease the focus of the areas you think are less important. If you want to read brief description of different areas, please refer to the help menu. Gameplay is important. And story quests, not very much because it's a military shooter, you know? Alright. Alright. Yes, sir, right. Alright, so you guys can just pause the video if you want to read those. I want much artificial intelligence. Dialogue's not really important because it's 1980s. Level design, I guess it's kind of important. I don't know, people didn't really care about them in the 1980s. Or I might be wrong. Either way, we got bugs. We got three bugs. Ugh, four. Stop. Stop. I am a perfect developer. Do not bug me. When you're in development, you can also select additional features for your game. Right now, you can only pick basic sounds, but your options will increase quickly. Need small features to make the game generally better, but also increase the cost. Graphics sound. Selected widget and graphics basic sounds. On both of them. Sound amazing. World design not really important. Graphic. Graphic and sound should be kind of equal. Stop it, bug! Go away! No! Who needs bugs? Bang, girl. Ooh, yeah. 
Release game. Oh my god. Oh yes, engine. How many research points do I have? Hey. Ooh. Fantasy. Ugh. Oh, I only have 12 research points. No wonder. Beautiful. Star games. Ha ha ha! Military in action is a great combination. Alright, so we got overall decent reviews. Dang, girl. Oh my god. Oh no, never mind. I thought I didn't know he was researching. Are you done the research in this? Um, there are scrolls. No, I'm too cheap. Go. Yeah, let's do 2D. Dang it, I already got bugs. Gameplay, all the way, son. Story and level quest, all the way, son. Engine, no. That doesn't need that great gameplay. Yeah. There we are. more importance well it's an RPG so I should have good level designs oh god all this stuff is important at least important to artificial intelligence so. so many bugs yeah, this already has as much bugs as the best game ever World design very important. Graphic not very important. Sound it's about the same as graphic. Crap, how long have I been recording? Probably not that long, but still. Dang, we need to iron out the bugs. Dang girl, release! And now we wait. From as far as I've seen my game, my, um, not my game, my friend play this, he gets to like, the Game Boy, it's not called the Game Boy here, but like, the Game Boy basically. This is this world's version of the Game Boy. Um, what do I do now? Okay, I'm gonna hold on. Damn it. Um, guess I'll develop a new game right now. What should we call this? Let's make a racing game. Um, super fastness ness. Ness. There we are. Big topic. Oh, there's no racing. Oh yeah, that's a different genre. Never mind. Um, let's change the name for this. Boom, 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 boom. All right, game concepts. Let's see. 
and stuff. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. Alright. That's the most expensive game I had to make so far. Boom. Cause I put it on the... Not important to dialogues. Mm -hmm. Hey, I did not click that. I guess graphics are pretty important. Not as much bugs on this one. I guess now I can research making my own game engine. Click. Research. Wow. Oi, oi, eight, eight. Ah. Oi, oi, oi. Four? E. Oh. Yes, yeah. alright, reviews. Hey! Ninvento. <laughs> Dinky King. Go Fiesta. Alright, once this part is over, I will finish the video. It's probably pretty short, because I haven't recorded that much, as far as I know. Ooh, aliens and stuff is selling like hotcakes. Rawr. Is there a close mission click anywhere to bring up the action menu? I'm gonna develop this, and then I'll end the video. Be so expensive. Oh, oh God. That, but I signed to buy the license and I forgot. I think that's 80,000. Not sure. Alright, guys, that'll be it for now. Thank you guys for watching. Shark out. Oh. Well, how nice, Pat, Patrick, and Daniel.